I'm sorry I couldn't get you more information about the Circle, Bethany. It's difficult without naming you. Thank you for being discreet. I don't want the Templars at my door. No one does. Let them corral the troublemakers. I just want information. Right. Right. It sounds like I'm trying to convince myself, doesn't it? I wouldn't have said, but yes. Sorry. Vivi Sebastian, stop this madness. The Chantry cannot condone revenge, Sebastian. It is my right, my duty, to show these assassins there is nowhere in the free marches to hide. This is murder. No. What happened to my family was murder. I think this is the cellar door. The Amel Crest. Mother described it, but the it's the first time I've seen it. Wouldn't it feel like something to live in a house with this above the door? Ah! <laughs> 
Did that bastard... Watch where you step. I knew I should have sleazed. Piece of cake. the vault. Everything we want to know about our family is inside. This is it. Grandfather's will. Mother needs to see this as soon as possible. We'll take it to her right now. So I'm just saying blood's blood and all but you are taking advantage of my hospitality. It's only fair if you make something of a monthly contribution. You sold my children into servitude. Now you're asking me to pay rent? Uh, maybe just put something towards food. We found the will. He forgave you, Mother. Grandfather left you everything. Here, read it. Uh, ah, I should, maybe... To my daughter Leandra, and all children born of her, the estate in Hightown and all associated revenues. What do you have to say for yourself? You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more important than money. It is! You didn't even come home for the funeral! The twins were a week old! We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, all he could talk about was Leandra. Look, sister, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't die angry. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. Make a willing. You'll have your house back within weeks. You don't have the coin or standing to even get an audience with the Viscount. You've got to be someone in this city to live in that house again. Then I had better get started. Why don't you go pick up something at the market? You could use some air. What? Hey! I can't believe Gamelin stole Mother's entire inheritance. I mean, I can believe it. That's the worst part. I could never turn against my own sister like that. You're a better person than Gamelin could ever be. Well, hopefully we'll be out of here soon. You know, when we went to look for that will, I thought we were doing it for Mother, for what she lost. I didn't realize how much it would mean to me to know I had grandparents who didn't hate me. They might have been all right with the Ferelden thing. But just imagine if they'd known you were an apostate. You're such a wretch. I was just hoping it would be different this time. Here in Kirkwall, we're not running away again. We're coming home. Are you unhappy here? 
I wish I could do more for Mother. Carver's death. It's killing her slowly every day. But maybe if we can reclaim some of what she lost, it will help. I'd do anything to get us back a normal life. Why did Mother and Father work so hard to keep you from the Circle? Would it have been so bad? I guess at first, I was just a little girl. They didn't want to lose me. And once I had learned anything, what would the Templars do to an active apostate, not just a mage blood child? It changed their lives, your life, Carver's, all because of who I am. Sometimes I wonder if it would have been so bad to be with my own kind, to serve the Chantry as Andraste demands. What do you think Carver would have made of all this? He would have hated this place, all the sneering nobles. He'd have gotten himself arrested the first day, and he would have wanted in on your Deep Roads expedition. Anything to make a name for himself. Sometimes I still can't believe he's gone. Can you imagine if we'd grown up here? Been nobility? Had grandparents who bought us all liege and silk dresses with lace petticoats? Father was a good man, but Mother gave up so much for him. Of course, if she hadn't worked up the nerve to elope, she probably wouldn't have been able to resist the Templars either. If we'd been born here, you'd be nothing more to me than a name the Circle kept in my file. We're going to make this our home, Bethany. I promise you. I hope so, sister. I'm so very tired of running. I found this when we were at the estate. I thought you should have it. Is it? I think this is Mother's betrothal portrait from when she was supposed to marry the Comte. Look! You can see the ring. Do you like it? I love it. My whole life, Mother's always been so sad and worried. All because of my cursed magic. I always wished there was some way to take that burden off her. It's nice to have a reminder of a time when she still knew how to smile. <laughs> 